Hi. Oh, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Awesome. So excited for your session. I am too. Very excited. Sweet. All right. So you got some friends looking out for you. <laughs> yes. All right. So um, you go by Lisa. Is that correct? Yes. yes. Okay. Or L. Or L. L. Okay. Um, what What do you prefer, Lisa or L? L. 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 It is. Okay. So what are we working on? We are working on um, chronic nightmares. Um, the trauma that I've had has uh, caused chronic nightmares for ten years. Every time I go to sleep, like, like every single time, like even naps. Yes. Wow. So this is like a ten out of ten. Like, correct. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. Um. All right. Let's do it. We'll have a, a quick moment of silence, and we'll see what we can do. All right, connect this proxy for you. I know that's no that's no fun to to hear about. Somebody says, uh, "Do you do emotion code for your kids?" For my kids, no. Oh, sorry, they were talking to me. Oh, um, okay. Yes, I do them for my kids. Can I give you a hug? Okay, give me a hug. Love you. Sorry, my need to. <laughs> Sorry, just putting my kids to, oh, you need a hug? Okay, sorry. I love you. No. Sleep good. Okay. okay. Love you. Love you. All right, sorry. Sorry about that. I told my husband I sent my kids up to get a hug tonight. So anyways, um, uh, I do sessions for my kids all the time. Anyways, so, <laughs> okay, let's do this. Okay, can I this proxy for you? Yes. Can I ask you something before we begin? Um, what have you done um, for the last 10 years to, to help with these? Have you done like any like saging or um, any uh, like, yeah, what have you done? Have you done anything? Yes, I have. <laughs> gone to therapy for 10 years straight and they have given me every kind of medicine they can give me and none of it works none of it works none of it works okay um okay let's ask can i get this proxy for you yes Okay, so we're going to go into um the body code a little bit this is a uh, the second certification that I have. Um, but this one um, is uh, an entity because I can feel it. Um, so entities are like, it's obviously to me, it's nothing to be scared of um, because entities or spiritual beings um, can affect the physical body. They can affect the energy body. Um, but I see them as just like any other energy. So, um, they don't really have power over you, um, unless like you give them power, if that, if you want to call it that, but, um, yes. it is one of the contributing things is nightmares. Okay. So do you, do we need to know more about this? Is there an associate balance? Okay. Let's hold the intention to release this entity from you. Command it to never bother you again and send it to the light. Let me correct that. Yes. Um, do you have another entity? No. All right. Um, now we're going to bounce back over to the emotion code. Do you have another, do you have an emotion we can release and that's causing these nightmares? Maybe even out of one, three, five. So creative insecurity. Creative insecurity is kind of like an insecurity to create things. So this could be like somebody squashing your creativity. Um, or anything like that. So when did this 10, 20, 30, 28, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, age 23. We need to know more. Okay. 
Let's go ahead and release that. Did we correct that? What's the biggest emotion we can release now that's causing these uh, nightmares? Maybe even two, four, six. Shock. When did this occur? 10, 20, 20, 19, age, 19. Do we need to know more? So let's go ahead and release that. Oh, you got some love in the comments. I love that. What's the biggest emotion we can release now that's causing these nightmares? Maybe even one heartache when did this push 10 20 h 20 we need to know more okay let's go ahead and release that did we correct that what's the biggest emotion we can release now that's causing these nightmares maybe even two four six shame when did this push 10 20 30 20 7 6 5 4 h 24 we need to know more okay Let's go ahead and release that. Did we correct that? What's the biggest emotion we can release now that's causing these nightmares? Maybe even two, four, six. Another shame. When did this reach 10, 20, age 20? Do we need to know more? Okay, let's go ahead and release that. that. What's the biggest emotion we can release now that's causing these nightmares? Maybe even two, four, guilt. When did this push 10, 20, 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, age 16? Do we need to know more? Okay, let's go ahead and release that. Can we correct that? What's the biggest emotion we can release and that's causing these nightmares? Maybe even two, four, six. Shame. When did this push 10, age 10? Do we need to know more? Okay, let's go ahead and release that. Did we correct that? Do you have another emotion to release now that's causing these nightmares? Come on, even two, four, six. Overwhelm. When did this push 10, 20, age 20? Do we need to know more? Okay, let's go ahead and release that. Did we correct that? What's the biggest emotion to release now that's causing this, um, these nightmares? I'm going to bounce back over to the body code. What is the biggest um, imbalance can really so that's causing these nightmares. Yes. Um, okay. This one says that it's, um, it's a stimulant toxicity. So it's basically like saying, um, this could be caffeine, um, cocaine, nicotine, like that type of stuff or anything that's like an upper, it's considered to be an upper or a stimulant. Um, this can also be like, Adderall medication or um, that type of stuff. Do we need to know more? Okay. Um, is there an associated imbalance? Okay. Let's see. Stimulant. Okay. What's the, let's go ahead and release that. Release the energy of this toxin from the body while at the same time directing the body to remove the toxin through its normal eliminating channels. <sighs> Do we correct that? What's the biggest imbalance we can release now? uh stress hormone toxicity so obviously um uh where's the words for that so the stress hormone toxicity sometimes if like your body holds on to adrenaline cortisol or noradrenaline for too long it's almost like the the chemicals themselves can get stuck inside of your body but also the energetic version of it so um, and then it's, it's like your body is not able to process and heal properly. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. Okay. When did this 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 40, 47, age 47, we need to know more. Okay. Let's go ahead and release that. We'll be intentional to release the energy of this toxin from the body while at the same time directing the body to remove the toxin through its normal eliminating channels. Did we correct that? Do you have another? All right. So over the next couple of days, I'm definitely going to recommend um, drinking lots and lots and lots of water. Um, this is going to help uh, flush some the not only the energy out, but also the um, the toxins that we just released. So um, yeah, I'm excited. 
I'm really excited. We won't know how you actually sleep until tonight. So <laughs> I don't know that we can get a number for that, but I am curious, do you feel any shifting or any changes? I really do. I, I feel lighter. Uh, I feel like I have a little bit more positive feeling about going to sleep tonight. Oh, but yay. a lot of the things you said were spot on. Spot really? on with me. Absolutely. I'm I'm so grateful to you. Yeah, so grateful. of course. I'm so happy for you. That's amazing. Oh, thank you so, so much. You're welcome. The only thing that I ask that you do tonight or not tonight, um, tomorrow is tell me how you sleep. Okay. You I do will. That? Yes. I will. Yes. Okay. Um, and then are you okay if I put this on my YouTube channel? Absolutely. Awesome. Um, Mm -hmm. Are you okay if I do one more thing for you? Yes. Okay. Let me grab this. So, um, just so you know, anybody else in the comments, the 29 other people that are here, if you would like to do this with us, you can. Um, I am going to hold the intention that it's for um, L. However, if you would like to do this for yourself or, you know, take on the words, for yourself you can as well um there's nothing wrong with that so i would like to place a shield over you that way you feel protected and you feel safe and um that way you will also it'll help you kind of like keep the entities out if that makes any sense so are you okay with that yes thank you okay. you're welcome so um, again, if you guys like to, would like to do this with me, you are more than welcome to. Um, so I am placing a shield around you. It covers you completely and is permanent and impenetrable. It will block all negative energies, courtings, entities, curses, negative words, energetic weapons, negative uh, emotions, negative vibrations and frequencies, or anything that has a negative effect on you, your mind, body, spirit, or, or your energy. You are a being of light and truth, and you are protected from negative people, places, and things but will allow positive energies and frequencies in. <sighs> Yay! Yeah. Yeah. Thank you so much. You're so welcome. So every single morning, what you're going to do, excuse me, what you're going to do is you are going to um, say shields up. I personally like to say shields up millionaire mama because I want to be a millionaire someday. But um, yeah. And then, cause sometimes at nighttime it can deactivate, but, um, for you, um, just hold the intention that it's going to be there all day, all night. And then, um, just as a reminder to make sure that you are protected, just say shields up right before bed. And then also when you wake up and, um, it'll be there. So thank you. Thank you for everything. You're so welcome. You. Yeah. Have a good one. You too. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.